time by for Landon Hocking and Katie Wilson, the 1X. Landon racing down the Grundy County Speedway as well as Katie, a former competitor down at the Ileana Speedway over in Indiana. Here's Schneiderville. Pace truck going to dive into the infield as Hocking and Wilson. The top five advance to the main tomorrow. The rest are racing in the bash. They're going to pick up speed. Here they come. They come. Green flag. And three wide right off the start there as Hocking didn't look like he caught up to speed as Wilson, your leader. Great battle for second between the Moose, Todd Snow, and Quinlan Jr. Hocking getting bounced around like a like a bouncy ball all over the racetrack. Making contact with Chanda. And here comes Hawking in the wall. Look out, Nick Young. Hawking slow here. This might bring out a caution. It does. Yellow flag, Hawking had all kinds of issues. And you saw right here going into turn one is Nick Young about went on two wheels going to the corner. We go this time by from the flagman, Dave Sankey. As Katie Wilson, your leader. She's got some hungry drivers behind her. Todd Snow in the 44 car is always competitive here at the Rockford Speedway. William Quinlan Jr. in the 4J right there as well. It's the top five advance into the, the mean tomorrow. The rest are going to race in the bash. Possibly later tonight, they're going to pick up speed. Here they come, they come. Green flag. And Snow got a solid start there. Looking to pick up speed, it looks like and Quinlan Jr. is going to fall off as here comes Schleck. Slusik for second. A lot of contact there. As Quinlan Jr. having all kinds of issues. Here comes Slusik. Challenging Wilson for the lead. The triple seven, the lucky car. Starting to pull away from the field. He's got to make sure he doesn't break out. He may break out here. Great battle here for third. The Moose Todd Snow challenging on the inside of Dustin Hensel for third. Snow on the hard inside. Snow having all kinds of issues. He's off the pace as Quinlan Jr. has got the final transfer spot. might have a flat tire. Here comes John M. Featherson for that final transfer spot. He does. And William Quinlan Jr. and Dustin Hensel have both broken out now, race fans. David McClep sits in second now, followed by John M. Featherston. Katie Wilson sits in fourth, white flag this time by for Jacob Slusik. Slusik. Here comes Zachary Chanda all over the back bumper of Katie Wilson. Chandra's on the last transfer spot. Check a flag this time by for Slusik. David McCluffs will finish second, followed by John Featherston. Zachary Chandra will finish fourth. Kendall Becker finishes fifth. So your heat race winner number one for the Double B comes to us all the way from Hebron, Illinois, or Hebron, Indiana. Races at the Plymouth Speedway, part of the Hornets class out there. It's the triple seven car of Jacob Slushik.